Nestled away near Barron River Lake in Barron County sets over 400 acres of family history, family tradition, and family love. It's the Moore Family Farm, started in 1810, and now Joe Michael Moore is running it. My great-grandfather always said, keep the farm in the family. There's no paperwork. Um, there was no inheritance. Uh, so I was fortunate enough to buy it from my great-uncle. I had to buy it and pay for it. Um, and then uh, we've added to the acreage. Uh, I started out with 100 acres, 103 actually, then bought five more from around the house. And now together we've got 468 acres, Andy and I together do. Um, and almost all of it is originally of the farm. There's about 40 acres uh, that's not that, we've, that we own. Uh, but that's where uh, my dad and mom moved when I was in the first grade. So I've got a little bit of that farm as well. Uh, when, uh, when I was a kid, we moved from here, but we still farmed the farm. My great granddaddy lived here and we still farmed it and, and helped take care of them up until they both passed away. You might hear Joe Michael Moore calling for cows on most days. Woo! Come on! But he's caring for a lot more. He's caring for chickens, he's caring for hogs, he's caring for pigs, he's caring for sheep, and the occasional llama. But Joe Michael is standing on 200 years worth of family tradition at his Barron County farm. His family started the farm in 1810 here in Barron County and they've continued ever since. All my dreams have come true. It started with a little boy sitting right up there on the corner there at, uh, at Finney. Uh, at Hanging Fork Missionary Baptist Church. From a little boy, I prayed that someday I would have a, a wife and kids. And I've actually probably prayed for everything that exists. I prayed for corn, I prayed for cows, I prayed for this, I prayed for that. It's unbelievable whether it did any good or not, I don't know about that, but I was happy doing it. Joel Michael started a teaching career in 1977 and continued that career until 2008. But the entire time, he was farming. He was keeping up a tradition that not only his father, but his great, 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 great grandfather began. Uh, but we've always been farmers. I taught school, my wife taught school. Uh, I taught agriculture, taught Vietnam veterans. Uh, today, I've been in several organizations. I'm fortunate enough to be uh, president of the Barron County Cattlemen's. Uh, I've been the director on the Kentucky Cattlemen's. Uh, with the Barron County Cattlemen's, we are the largest membership in the state of Kentucky. Kentucky has the most cattle uh, east of the Mississippi, so um, I'm all about agriculture. While the future is never certain, the kids may never process sausage again, or there might never be a farm. But one thing is for certain, the farm is staying in the family. You know, this is not for sale. Not one million, not two million, not five million. It's not for sale because uh, I'm happy. This is what I want. Uh, I don't have to have a condo as long as I got a little money. I might can rent me a Holiday Inn room. Uh, I don't have to have a jet airplane. I can buy uh, uh, tickets and fly to wherever I need to fly to if I want to go. And uh, you know, I can. I don't have to have a Mercedes or whatever. I, you know, Ford, Chevrolet. They've always been pretty good to me. There's one thing that's never faded at the Moore Family Farm, and that's love. Love has sustained the farm. The farm has been sustained by love. And Joe Michael Moore says that his family is everything. Still, when you're grounded with the right kind of root system, I think you can hang on pretty good. And, and we, uh, you know, I for one, uh, I have a wonderful family. Uh, my wife has helped me every day. Uh, uh, she gave me two great kids, and now I got son-in-law, daughter-in-law, grandkids. Uh, I guess I could say I'm probably one of the happiest people on earth. This is Joe Michael Moore. And this has been Meet My Neighbor.